My name is Benjamin Longstaff. In about 2013, I was serving in the children's ministry here at Northland, playing guitar for worship. And there was this one kid who always just was right in the front row, and he always had this huge smile on his face, and he was just rocking out. And my mom approached me and was like, hey, he has special needs, and he really would like a buddy. And so I got involved at Nathaniel's Hope, and it started with me bringing a guitar, and I was his buddy, and we would just rock out and, and just have a good time. And I think that's what really started it. We got involved with Buddy Break probably close to 10 years ago. When we first heard about Buddy Break, we were a little leery. We live in a city where we don't have family, and we had friends, but they weren't really comfortable and didn't know about disability. So you tend to just kind of, you know, just turn inward, and, and you know, your social circle just starts to get smaller and smaller a lot of times. We decided to do it, and it really has been one of the best things for Elijah. It was tremendous for our marriage. For Ben to bring Elijah up with him and for Elijah to lead worship and for Elijah's dream, basically, to be fulfilled of performing on stage and singing praises to the Lord has just, has just been an amazing thing for myself and for, for his dad, for my husband. Me and Ben always rock out our guitars. Ben is super cool, super hip, and I like his haircut, and that's about it. Daniel's Hope Buddy Break is much more than you can see on the surface. Not only does it, you know, give parents a welcome environment that they can leave their kids in and know that they're going to have this amazing, fun, and carefree time where the kids can just be kids and just really enjoy themselves. The people who volunteer that have made such a difference in the lives of so many children, of so many parents, we cannot even begin to thank you. because you love our kids and you give us that time so that so many times that we need and we don't get at home. And I just, there's not enough words to say how thankful we are for the volunteers who love our kids and give us that break that we so desperately need sometimes. So volunteers, you are amazing and thank you.